What's up? So, I get a call this morning. Well, actually last night. And uh, this morning, I sent the information to a friend who was telling me about the diagnosis they got. And I said, all right, here's exactly what needs to be done. Here's what you need to take. And this is how this is going to play out. But remember this. If you're not willing to change your lifestyle, then you're choosing to have no life. Honestly, there is no pill that is going to overcome lifestyle, a poor lifestyle. There is no, there's nothing that's going to overcome. If you don't change, things are not going to change. She says, I must look hideous because I told her she need, had to get in the gym. It's one of those conditions where you must work out. It's like just there. And I was like, you know what? You can be pretty in a casket. You're still in a damn casket. You can be pretty and not able to enjoy life. You're still no fun. You can be pretty and immobile. You're still worthless. You can be pretty and have a horrible attitude and you're still ugly, honey. So here's the deal. You either accept life on life's terms and say, I have had poor choices up till now and I am going to change these things because without a doubt, that is going to change me, my life. It's going to give me life. It's going to extend my life. It's going to make things better. It's going to make me more healthy. It's going to make life worth living again. Or you're going to die in your ignorance. And it's a choice. That damn simple. That's how it works. That's how real health care or real treatment of disease actually works. I'll provide you with everything you need, but if you don't do your part, you choose death, and that's okay. Like, freedom is a beautiful thing. You can kill yourself in any way you wish. I would hope and choose that everyone would choose to be healthy, would choose to live, but some don't. And there's nothing we can do about that. Now, my only job is to recommend to you the most logical, straightforward path to what you ask me to get you. This means if you want to live and be healthy and happy and whole, I'm here to provide. If you want to get big and strong and even risk your life in the process, who am I to judge? I'll tell you how to get there. If you want somewhere in the middle, I'll do my best to meet what you lay out as your goal. But the more clearly you define that goal, the more easily I can assist. General terms lead to general recommendations. Direct and exact clarity in your goal will lead to a direct and exact path to get there very quickly. So, anyway, I just thought I'd let you know that it's kind of like, it reminds me of like raising kids. You can raise a child and say you love them while you do everything for them and make them earn nothing. And when you're gone, they're worthless and they go to jail or they die from, you know, not being able to have self-control. Or you can truly love that child and you can go, Nope, you're going to pick your crap up. Yes, you're going to earn your way and you're going to earn your keep. And if you don't, then you're going out the door to see if you can make it on your own. That kind of love means when you're gone, they can make it without you. Now, the first feels good. The second is good. The choice is yours. You can create children that grow up to be big, but still children, inept, or 
you can create amazing individuals that can handle life and take life by her hand and lead her around and show her what she's going to do for them and enjoy every minute of it. But it's your choice as to what you're going to do. A few simple disciplines practiced every day equals success. A few simple failures repeated daily equals ultimate failure. We all have the choice. Choose wisely, daily, consistently. You'll get it. Love y'all. Newsarms.com. Seth Williams.